Hey guys, welcome back and in today's video, I'm going to discuss how you can use Quora to help you choose the right product to sell on your Shopify store. Also later on, I'll be talking more about Shopify and its features, so make sure to stick around for that. Also, if at any point throughout this video you want to check out and try Shopify for yourself, you can benefit from a 3 day free trial as well only pay $1 per month for the first 3 months by clicking the link in the description down below. Alright now, I understand that finding the perfect product is an important step in building a successful online business. And with Quora being a popular question and answer platform, it can provide valuable insights and help you identify trends and market demands and I'll show you how. Now before diving into Quora, it's important to have a clear understanding of your niche. So by determining the industry or market you want to target and identify the specific interests and needs of your target audience, it will help you narrow down your search on Quora and find relevant um, discussion. So after that, you need to visit Quora's website and use the search bar to look for topics related to your niche. For example, if your niche is fitness, you can search for keywords like fitness products, workout equipment, or healthy lifestyle. And while you browse through the questions and answers on Quora, pay attention to the ones that are highly upvoted or have a larger number of responses. Now, these indicate popular topics and areas of interest within your niche. So look for questions that revolve around product recommendations, common problems, or emerging trends, which can give you your insights into potential product ideas. And so observing recurring themes and patterns. Ask yourself, are these specific products or solutions that are frequently mentioned so requested? So take note of the products that seem to generate a lot of interest or solve common problems. In addition to that, pay attention to any emerging trends or new product categories that are being discussed. Now, once you've gathered insights from Quora, conduct additional market research to validate the demand and viability of the product idea you've identified. You can benefit from using tools like Google Trends, keyword research tools, and social media platforms that'll help you gauge um, market interest, competition, and potential profitability. So based on the information you've gathered from Quora and your market research, narrow down your options and select a product that best aligns with your market demands, has good profit potential, and matches your interest and expertise. Now that you've chosen your product, it's time to build your Shopify store. You need to make sure to focus on creating an attractive and user-friendly website, optimize product descriptions and images, and implementing effective marketing strategies to promote your product to your target audience. And that's all. So by leveraging Quora and following these steps, you can use the platform to help you choose the best product to sell on your Shopify store. Now, let me tell you more about Shopify and its features so you can be well informed about everything before opening your store. And so I've been testing out some of the most popular e-commerce platforms out there and I found Shopify to be the best platform overall for a variety of reasons. Starting with customization. Now, Shopify has a massive library of both free and paid themes that'll help your your business stand out. So once you start building your online store, you can browse a bunch of theme templates and pick the one that best suits your business. And while you're building your website, you can either add or remove different sections of these templates using Shopify's intuitive editing menu. Now this menu gives you everything you need throughout your website building process, including adding headers, feature collections, announcement bars, and so on. And to top it all off, all the sections on this website builder operate on a drag and drop basis which lets you swap locations between different website components seamlessly and gives you more control over the creation process. And you'll also have access to a portfolio of over 20,000 stock images, which makes website creation much easier, especially for smaller businesses that don't have these type of resources. Now, it's also worth mentioning you can check how your website looks on both the desktop version and the mobile version at any time during the creation process. So this way you can see what works and what could be changed before you go ahead and launch your website. Moving on to another great aspect of Shopify, which is its ease of use. Now, the service caters to individuals and businesses of all skill levels, which makes it a universal choice for most people. Now, you don't need to worry about all the technicalities of building a website because everything is taken care of by Shopify. All you have to do is upload your products and customize the website however you see fit without having to worry about hosting the website, doing maintenance, or any other hoops that you normally have to go through when building an online store. And when it comes to products, 
products, you can even create several collections and sub collections with a couple of clicks and have them displayed on your front page. Now, one of my favorite ease of use features is the AI generated item description. And so instead of thinking of a powerful description for every single item, all you have to do is input the item type and pick a tone for the description and it'll automatically do it for you. And another great feature is the drop shipping integration. Now, if your business is based on drop shipping, you can link most suppliers to your shop and it'll automatically upload their products, quantities, and descriptions to your store. And speaking of quantities, Shopify automatically handles your stock management once you input the item quantity and will display sold out to your customers when the stock drops down to zero. You could even turn this feature off so that your item always appear in stock regardless of how many are actually available. And besides that with Shopify, you'll get analytics section to show you valuable data such as your website visitor, total sales, returning customer rates, average order value, and more. Now this feature gives gives you a more professional outlook to your business and helps you figure out what's working and what's not. Now moving on to subscriptions. Now Shopify caters to businesses of all sizes and offers all the central features across their three subscription tiers, which are basic, Shopify, and advanced. Now, if you're running a small business and you're just starting out, I highly recommend the basic tier as it offers you everything you need to build an online store right from the get-go. Now, as you go up in tiers, you'll get extra features that'll help you scale your online store to match the size of your business. So for example, the Shopify tier gives you all the essentials offered in the basic tier on top of professional business reports. It also increases the number of staff accounts from two to five, which gives room for more staff members to manage your online store. Now, similarly, the advanced Shopify tier will give you much more customizable reports on top of bumping the staff number from five, well, to 15. But that's not all Shopify has to offer as they also have customizable tiers that you can choose from. For example, you have the Shopify Plus tier, which caters to huge businesses as it offers unlimited staff on top of personalized support. You also have the Commerce Components Bundle, where you get to pick and choose the options you want and then request a quote from the Shopify team. And so regardless of the size of your business with Shopify, you'll always find a plan that fits your needs and preferences. And finally, when it comes to payments, unlike other e-commerce platforms, Shopify does not charge a percentage of each transaction. Instead, they only charge a 2% fee when the payment is done through a third-party payment service integrated within your platform. Now, if you have Shopify payments, you won't be charged third-party transaction fees for orders that are processed through Shopify payments, ShopPay, ShopPay installments, and PayPal Express, and you aren't charged transaction fees on manual payment methods such as cash, cash on delivery, and bank transfers. All you have to do is fill out the Shopify payment section, and you're good to go. So overall, Shopify is the best e-commerce platform regardless of your business size. Now, they cater to users of any skill level through a plethora of features and have some of the most advanced customization options out there, getting your online store up and running in virtually no time. So that's it for this video. Again, if you want to try out Shopify for yourself, you can check the link in the description down below and benefit from a three-day free trial. Only pay $1 per month for the first three months. And feel free to comment down below if you have any questions, as I love getting to interact with you guys. And like and subscribe if you found this video helpful or let's like stay up to date with future videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.